for those Legos, mm -hmm, huh? Yeah. yeah. I don't think they've done that before. Run out of conversation. Do you think they're going to play I Spy much? <laughs> Wonder about that. Maybe so, Jackie. That's good. All right. Well, I am spying some marine layer and some cooler temperatures moving in. Oh, so, good. Okay. Yeah, so that's great news because uh, I know folks have had great weather at the coast, but everywhere else it has been hot, it has been humid, and it is finally going to start to cool down some uh, no matter where you are. You can enjoy some nice weather as we head into the end of the week and the weekend. Look at all the folks kind of jealous. <laughs> They're all enjoying the beach there in Santa Monica and at the pier where it is just lovely out there. Plenty of sunshine today, and we will see the return of the marine layer tonight, not only at the coast, but it will be spreading all the way inland, and that's a sign of a change to come. But temperatures today also much cooler than they've been. Finally, closer to normal downtown. We had a high today of 82. 81 is our normal high. And inland right now, the last few days, inland, uh, even in Van Nuys, we've been into the 90s and triple digits. So uh, upper 80s right now doesn't seem so bad. It is still on the warm side in Lancaster with temperatures at 99. And along the coast, temperatures are into the upper 60s to low 70s. Just know it is going to be breezy over the next few days, but that'll actually make it feel very comfortable outside should be below advisory level winds. You can see the marine layer hugging the coast right now. And again, the low clouds and fog will be spreading inland overnight tonight through tomorrow morning. The monsoonal moisture and the instability stayed just off to our east today. So we saw plenty of showers and thunderstorms, but again, it did not work its way into our area. So it was a pretty quiet day, and it's going to get even quieter as this ridge of high pressure continues to move out to the east. And as that happens, we've got this trough of low pressure well to our north, but that's going to dig a little bit deeper. What that means for us is we're just going to have an onshore flow, cooler temperatures, and that is going to bring in the marine layer. So keep in mind, uh, it might be cooler, but at the coast, we might see more clouds as we head into the weekend and for your 4th of July. So clouds and fog spreading inland overnight tonight. Whenever we have clouds at night, that actually keeps our overnight lows up because it is holding in the day's heat. So temperatures will still only get down to around 66 for the overnight lows. Your Friday looking good, low 70s at the coast and upper 70s in the LA and OC metro areas. Upper 80s inland and in the valleys Friday into Saturday, but Sunday into your 4th of July. Uh, it doesn't get much better than this. 70 at the beaches, 79 in the LA and OC metro areas, inland and in the valleys. Highs could very well be in the triple digits, but instead the warmest spots I'm seeing only getting into the low 90s. So very comfortable out there. Uh, we will have the marine layer at night and in the morning hour, so it might impact the fireworks at the coast only. Uh, and the nice weather sticks around all the way into next week.